Horoscopes by 1PKC.io, brought to you by Jeff Helkenberg. Hello Libra, this is your horoscope for the week of March 18th, 2019. Now currently the house of Libra is empty this week, except for the moon, which will transit the house in the late week. Meanwhile, your ruling planet, Venus, remains in Aquarius. And so the theme here is that you continue to seek out unusual circumstances and unusual situations. You're kind of like an explorer who wants to kind of go into the unknown. If you see a cave, you're going to go in there. You want to be the first one to walk upon the surface of some new landscape. And so you really feel like now is a time to get out and do new things and, and try to have new experiences. It's not necessarily because you're coming from a place where you feel bored. It's just that you're coming from a place where you actually are positively motivated to have new experiences. You desire it. Not, you're not avoiding a negative situation. You're chasing a positive situation. And that's an important distinction because that means that you're really motivated to experience new things. And you're, and you're, so, so it's kind of like your afterburners are on right now. You're really going out there and you want to do new you want to have new experiences you want to do new things and that's a big big thing for you this week now something that's likely to happen is that others might try to hold you back and they're really going to be uncomfortable seeing you willing to take risks to have these new experiences and so you're going to have to make a call this week as to whether or not you're going to listen to those other voices that are asking you to kind of dial it back and maybe not be so outgoing and, and they're, they're going to feel a little bit uh, disoriented by this new attitude that you have, that you really have this strong desire to get out there and uh, have new experiences. Well, it's also spring, you know, and the, the air is warming up and people are excited to get out. And so there are a lot of things pulling you in this direction. And then there are going to be some voices, possibly voices very close to you, might even see some ultimatums, although it doesn't look as much like that, but it might be an us or them kind of moment or someone very close to you might, might be so dissatisfied with this new energy that you're presenting that they'll, they'll tell you that if you don't dial it back, they're going to leave you. So, I mean, you may have some big, significant issues to confront this week related to people trying to digest your attitude about having new experiences. So that's going to be something that you're going to have to deal with. There is no way to forecast whether it's going to be a good or bad outcome. It's just something that you should look out for. And you know, you're going to have to make a choice. Do you want to go do those new things and meet new people and have all those new experiences? Or do you want to help comfort the people that you're close to to make them feel more comfortable and maybe maybe ramp up your desire a little bit more slowly something for you to work through this week now for those of you who know your birth chart positions here's a rundown of the other planets and our star mercury is in retrograde in pisces venus is in aquarius mars and uranus are in taurus jupiter is in sagittarius Saturn and Pluto are in Capricorn. Neptune is in Pisces, where it is joined by the Sun. And the Moon will start the week in Leo, move through Virgo and Libra, and will end the week in Scorpio. So again, you're feeling it. It's wanderlust, however you want to put it. You definitely want to go out there and have some new experiences. But there are people who are close to you who are very disoriented by that. And so you're going to have to make some tough calls this week.